Welcome to Guruvira Textile and Fashion Technology Tutorial. Hi friends, how are you? Please subscribe to my channel Guruvira Textile and Fashion Technology Tutorials. Okay, leveling acid dyes. Leveling acid dyes. Before going to this topic, acid dyes are classified based upon their nature, they based upon their qualities, properties or characteristics. Already I took basic class on acid dyes which is running popularly and next last week I took other dyes like the uh, uh, molecularly split dyes, acid dyes, aggregated acid dyes in two languages both Hindi and in, uh, English and this third class is leveling class and another class what this leveling acid dyes, milling acid dyes, super milling acid dyes. Okay. After molecularly split acid dyes or aggregated acid dyes, again the class of dyes are considered under leveling and milling and super milling. I will take class on milling and super milling in the next videos. Now today's video is on leveling acid dyes. Friends, what is leveling acid dyes? These dyes, leveling acid dyes, why the leveling? The name itself, it's indicated that level. Most of the cases nowadays in weaving industries, dyeing industries or the fabric after weaving packing industries where the inspection is taken place in the textile dyeing mills or where the it, fabric inspection takes place in the garment export house, warehouses. Most of the cases, defects are identified. I am not talking defects about the other classes of defects, dyeing defects, crease mark, uneven shades, dark and light shades, uneven uh, shades observed in inspections table. So that kind of shades, acids, dyes are many kinds are there, many types are there and manufactured by many brands worldwide, United States, US, Italy, Germany, India, Australia, everywhere it is manufactured. And specialty here is the first leveling acid dyes is produced by not, not first the SIBA, the manufacturer, the brand, the SIBA manufacturer. First, they started this production leveling acid dyes, this class of acid dyes, and given the name ketone, brand name ketone, K I T O N, ketone, I written here ketone. And that is utilized, the brand name ketone is utilized for this class of dyes, leveling acid dyes. So it becomes popular. And how it is became popular? Most and rest after that SIBA, after SIBA, what other manufacturers started, what other brands have started with the other brand name or trade names, this class of dyes. And they are all referred as ketone, ketone class of dyes. They were forgotten leveling dyes, they have started ketone dyes of cluster. Whatever that dyes popularized or marketed, sold uh, under the class of ketone class, ketone. Okay. So the that class of dyes, like that milling dyes, uh, super milling dyes, many class of dyes are there. The taste, the how the characteristics of dyes, even though the original base dye is acid dyes, under the acid dyes, technical term acid dyes, again the dyes are categorized into different kinds based upon the different characteristics, different qualities about the solubility in nature, different solubility in nature, about how they behave with the fibers. Okay, those, okay, these dyes belongs to molecularly split acid dyes. I told molecularly split acid dyes is molecular split acid dyes means, please watch my this video is there on this molecular split acid dyes. When the dye is in the powder form, paste form or any form is, is added in the water, uh, immediately it will dissolve completely like sugar in water or like sugar in milk, salt in water like that. Clear cut solution will happen. Such characteristics, such solubility characteristics this class of dyes have. And I, I, again I am repeating leveling means this acid dyes are used to produce the dye effect on the fabric so that 
the all width wise of the fabric or full length of the fabric have the same shade same shade consistency should be there shade consistency should be same throughout the length of the fabric that may be 500 meter or 1000 meter or 10000 meter same shade and width wise also same there is no variation at all light or dark or nothing is there so such kind of dye level is very difficult in other types of acid dyes mainly this leveling acid dyes is used for the woolen products woolen products where woolen products usually of high heavy grams per square meter fabrics wool fabrics are of heavy fabrics not uh, like lightweight fabrics those are more weight more than 400 uh, grams per square meter and more for such heavy fabrics leveling acids are used protein for wool is a protein fibers for leveling acids are used please remember friend why woolen fabrics are written or products made from woolen fabrics are written only dry cleaning or wash in cold water ha huh? dry cleaning is preferred why dry cleaning is preferred for woolen products why because of this class of dyes is used because the main the priority is given for level dyes not for the fastness if the woolen products dyed with this leveling dyes washed in a water like other clouds then color will bleed wash fastness of this leveling dyes are very less poor wash fastness is very poor and wet treatments given whether if taken for the garment treatments garment wet treatment uh, uh, treatments like enzyme wash or other stone wash other things or any other finishes having solve having dissolved in the chemicals no the products used for dry this is applicable recommended dry cleaning is recommended okay and dissolve very clearly friends ability to dye evenly evenly to dye the name itself it's ability to dye leveling superior superior leveling is given this type of dye is gives superior leveling okay and best for solid single shade no shade variation already told it is best for solid color single shade solid color the best swelling dyes especially for protein fibers like wool silk okay and natural fibers and angora mohair and synthetic fibers like nylon these fibers fabrics products are preferred for this acid dyes best for single color acid dyes solid color it should be solid heavy weight no variation where the no variation is not required preferred not usually used for direct application of dyes direct application of dyes means here painting not painting for printing sometimes many of the dyes applications are used for printing okay reactive dyes pigments and also pigments and some other pigments are used for printing applications direct direct applications like printing okay direct transformation to transformation to the fabric like that it is not preferred because leveling dyes requires to add or attach to the fibers first of all uh, it is a nature of it it requires to dissolve go into the structure of the fiber then only not on the surface because if it is attached to the surface usually printing are done fabrics are printed block print screen print whatever printer printed that print is happened on the surface maximum even whatever the treatment is given maximum it is not going 100% into the molecular morphology of the fibers so wash wash is but such printed fabrics are washed then print will go out so not preferred for direct applications used for i told fibers whatever fibers are there not used for cellulose fibers say this class of dyes are not preferred for cellulose fibers cellulose content fibers like cotton linen hemp jute okay these are the cellulose fibers are there and uh, even for what you call other than nylon even uh, for polish other than nylon in synthetic means uh, polished fibers acetate fibers acrylic fibers okay olefin fibers so many other things are there for that it is not recommended leveling dyes and poor wash fastness are told it is a very poor fastness why poor washing fastness because whatever the affinity is there affinity between dye molecules and the fiber molecules chemical substance of the chemical groups of the fibers or chemical uh, content of the molecules affinity is very loose bonding will be there 
not like reactive dyes. In case of reactive dyes, strong bonding will be there. Reactive dyes are strongly chemically bonded with coal and bond with the OH group and other groups of the fibers, polymers. It is not like that. Weak broken. If any mechanical uh, fastness mechanic, if fabric is product is subject to mechanically or under what you call in washing. In washing, is there no washing? That is any mechanical subject. The bind broken will be, bonds will be mechanical bonds will be broken. So weak bonding will be there. So washing fastness will be less and dry cleaning is preferred. Friends, this is about the introduction of the leveling dyes. So now I'm coming to here. Present, what is there? Ketone, already told Siva. Ketone is used. And when the Siva manufactured this uh, leveling, this kind of leveling dyes, okay, they use the name as ketone. After that, Siva then merged with Geji, the other manufacturer. They together, they collaborated, company manufacturing collaboration. After that, they given this class of dyes and marketed as, trade as the name Aereo, the name Aereo. This is also called Aereo class of dice or Ketone class of dice. Okay, now. next, this class of dice, what are the other manufacturers are there, other brands are there available in the market? This leveling dice are marketed, what are the other brands, other manufacturers? Entra, Sedizer, Sandalon, Amacid, Testilon, Orco Acid, Ketone Acid dice, I told, what is that? Permalon, Dye acid like that, different manufacturers are there throughout the world. United States, Italy, Germany, UK, Australia, India, China, wherever, Pakistan, almost what I'm saying industries, even the main uh, what you call main head office is there, branch will be there. Their production units are all in different countries will be there. Main countries for chemical dyes, US and European countries. Okay. And also this class of dice. Why this class of dice is Australian? Australia is also a preferred most of them. I, I, I'm not here. I don't have space to write. I don't have space to write here. I don't have space to give a lecture. Australia, merino wool. They are Australia is famous for merino wool production. Merino wool for where the merino, merino wool is used for nowadays active wears, huh? skin touch wears, very good quality cloths, high quality fabrics, fine cloth, fine wool fabrics are garments are produced from merino wool from Australia. So in Australia, wool means definitely they should have the dye manufacturing facilities related to the wool. So definitely they have the good, their products are n number of products they have, all kinds of products, wool, household or clothing, many kinds, industrials and other things. So definitely they have, you can search Google search and get it. Okay, now, now it interests the other. And what are the characteristics? Uh, characteristics while dyeing this level, uh, at what conditions this leveling dyes are uh, dyed? Usually, friends, formic acid to maintain to the dye level, acid is also required. I told you this class of dyes is belongs to molecularly split acid dyes. Molecularly split acid dyes to increase to maintain the what you call dye affinity between the protein fibers and substance to meant to increase the affinity between the fibers and the chemicals sorry dyes acid concentration is required presence of acid is required that i told in the other class molecularly split acid dyes so for what we will do neutral bath is not good for this class of dyes so what you call h2so4 sulfuric acid is added or CH3COH, formic acid is added. Sulfuric acid or formic acid is usually added for this molecular split acid dyes, leveling acid dyes, to increase the affinity. To increase the affinity, this acid presence is required in the dye bath. Okay, now, and pH of the dye bath, so it should not be, uh, because this name itself indicating acid dyes are there. So, alkali pH should not be in alkali in nature. It should be acidity, pH, pH should be towards acid. Usually 2 to 4 pH will be maintained. 2 to 4 is acid. Okay. If acid is not, if, if acid is not there, what will happen? The dye will not take place. 
then leveling property already it is meant for level only good fastness to washing poor molecular weight low why molecular weight why what is the molecular weight because molecular these are this when add in the water this dies immediately dissolved completely clear cut solution will happen like salt in water like milk in sorry sugar in sugar in milk so such dies there is no need to tell definitely they have definitely they have low molecular weight their weight are very less but not aggregated molecular weights in aggregated the clusters will be there the weights are more okay na so what other conditions are there solubility in water yes they are soluble easily high solubility colors affinity to proteins affinity to proteins are very low affinity towards proteins are low to increase the affinity towards protein fibers wool silk presence of acids are required sulfuric acid or cacoh are required okay na so temperature is elemental okay and for cellulosic fibers no staining it is cellulosic fibers or not prefer for this dyes friends this is about the leveling class of acid dyes in acid dyes other two class of dyes are coming those are all melling acid dyes and super melling acid dyes so thank you very much friends to stay with us please subscribe to my channel guruvira textile and fashion technology tutorials please share to your friends like it please click the bell icon for the notification of my videos thank you very much